What's up guys, back with another vlog. These vlogs are flying out these days, aren't they? We've just had a, a new vlog, and now we're gonna have another. Happy days, I, I, I feel like I'm gonna vlog more often now. I really like vlogging, it's so easy, and it's so fun. Every vlog is different, every vlog is different. But yeah, right now just sit here chilling, watching some syndicate Minecraft. We just had a bowl of Cocoa Pops, we've got a yogurt, and we've got some apple juice. And today, what I have to do is go to A1 Properties to pick up a key because Jerry's gone to Ireland for two weeks and he's left some bags in his room that need to be taken by the big men. <sighs> that boy does my Sweden. Now, but yeah, go down to A1, get a key, get the bins out or whatever, and then return the key. Just like that. Just like that. So, let's get a fucking move on, shall we? Quick Prime Energy Lemon and Lime test. Right, open it with one hand. Ugh. I've tried the bottle version, obviously, and that's all right. Let's see what this one tastes like. And don't say lemon and lime. Again, much bottle, much bottle, much better than the bottled version. The last one I tried, it was the ice pop one, and that is better than the bottled version. I feel like these ones are better than the bottles. And just like that, we are off to A1 Properties to go and get the spare key. And what a beautiful day it is today! What a beautiful day! Blue sky, bit of sun. I think I might have to have a nice, lovely pint on my way back. Hmm. Well, actually, no, it's too early. It's only just here, 12 o'clock. Nope, nope. Don't have a pint. My brain says yes, the sun says yes. I'm going to have to override that and say no. I'll have one later. Later on, later on. I've got things to do. I have things to do inside. Alright, so we've got the key. Now to sort out whatever the hell it was I had to sort out. His bin or something. Messy bastard. Messy fucker. Jerry, I hope you're watching this, mate. You, you owe me two pints of beer and you also owe me two prime cans because you stole my blue brass from the fucking fridge right i think it's just this bag that i just need to take out and just put it in the bin outside i don't think there's anything else i think i literally just had to go and get a key just open this door just to get this bag I'm not 100% sure, I could be wrong just waiting on a reply from him because i've asked him if it's just this bag whilst i'm waiting for his reply I need to pee. Still waiting on a reply here. Whilst I'm waiting for a reply, I'm gonna eat the three strawberries that are left. Strawberries are the best fruit, man. They are the best fruit, and if you disagree, then you're just some kind of alien. Mmm! 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 I love strawberries! Mmm! Ah! Uh. Mmm! Still no reply yet. Sorry, I'm waiting for a reply because I kind of just want to take the key down as soon as possible. I don't want to start doing something and then get a reply and then being like, okay, now I'll have to take the key back. I want to take it back as soon as possible just so I get on with my day! Ah! Alright, so we're going to reply. It was just that one fucking bag. Okay, yeah, okay, cool. Lovely, sorted, now time to return the key and get on with my fucking day. <gasps> now to leave him a note on his bed for when he comes back in two weeks. Two pints and two prime cans, please and thank you. XO, XX, love heart. Here we go, leave it on his bed. And now his door is locked. Now to walk all the way back down to the bottom of town to anyone property to return this key. Okay, so my next plan of action is to go to Tesco and get myself a meal deal. I'm in... in Play meal deal mood. I'm just praying that I have the chicken stuff and sandwich because that is the best thing on the meal. The reds are my, the reds are light, so I need to cross like now. Exactly what the doctor ordered: chicken and stuff and sandwich, oasis, and a white Twix. Right, here's a conversation in the comments section. I want to know what you guys get for your meal deal. What's your sandwich, snack, and drink? Comment it. Comment down below what you guys get. I want to know what you guys get from Tesco's or it can be Morrison's or any other supermarket. Let me know what your choice of meal deal is. Well, let's have a debate in the comments. 
what the best sandwich drink and snack is. Right, we've got we've got our meal deal. We've started the computer. Let's open Premiere Pro and let's get editing mine and Dylan's collaboration when we got destroyed drinking shots. Just another day at the office. Little did I know that I have to download the footage onto my, uh, you know, PC from Google Drive. So while that's been happening, I've been pumping my bike tires up again because I might have a little spin on the bike in a bit. It's been a while since I've been on it, but I do need to get another kind of WD-40 because that bike really, really, really needs it. In time to come, I will take it to the bike shop to get the full service it needs because that because i took it to get like new brakes because like there was one brake that was like about to fall off like what no not brake gear changer so i got a new gear things on, on them they near enough said to me the bike wasn't safe to ride it was quite pricey at the time for a full for like the full whack to get everything changed and sorted out but you know because i'm going to university in september once i get the student loan that's gonna be one of the first things i'm gonna do is get that bike the full service it needs and then actually look after it and get a cover, a cover for it for when it rains. Yeah, don't leave your bikes outside. That's the mistake I've done with every single bike I've ever owned in my whole entire life is leave them outside and they get rusty. Let's get some WD-40. Spray the shit out of it. Honestly, I swear, I'm back and forth to the shops like a fucking yo-yo. Like I managed to secure some WD-40 from Poundland. It's only a small bottle, but that will do for now. Right, we've got our WD-40. Time to give the bike a good spray. And let's carry on with our video that we're editing. Now that's sorted, back to the editing. I haven't even started editing yet. I'm, I've just been trying to put, download the clips. And oh my god, it's been a, like a shit show. Oh my god, help me, Lord help me. Ah! Right, so essentially what I've been doing like the past fucking hour or so, I've just been trying to organise all the clips together because some reason when I was downloading Dylan's phone camera footage, it was downloading it really fucking weirdly. It was like downloading it, they were all in separate files for some reason. One file had two clips, another had one, some had four, some had three. I'm like, ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. So then uh, extracting all of them was taking a bit of time. And then I was organizing them so they're in one folder. Oh my god. It actually drains me a little bit. So I'm going to go for a spin on my bike and just continue later on. Yeah. Oh, also, uh, I've transitioned now to uh, kick streaming. Bear with me, I'll show you guys now. I have made the transition over to kick streaming, so make sure you follow me, Walker HD. You know, look, it's spelt properly this time. I don't have to deal with two R's in it or any underscores or whatever like that. So make sure you follow me on kick. Link will be in the description. I'm going to be streaming here from now on. So yeah, follow me up, bitches. We are going to go to Morrison's for a little trip to take this to the pharmacy. It's full of like insulin needles and stuff like that, so I can get a fresh box because it's quite full now. So, uh, yeah, it's still open, closed at half six, the pharmacy. So, we're all good, we're all good. And now, let's get on the bicycle because it's too far to walk. Now, right, an old friend, it's been a while. Let's go to Morrison's. In all fairness, she's still got it. She might be a bit rusty, literally, and a bit rusty with the gears, literally again, but still a bit clunky with the gears, but she's still got it. She's still got the magic. What I wish I could do was attach an engine, a motor thing to it so I can make it electric, because those things are a dream. My dad has one. And once, when I used it to get from here, well, from where I live now, all the way to my parents' house, it took a total 17 minutes. I used it on full fucking throttle. 
17 minutes. On a normal bike, it would take me about an hour. 17 fucking minutes. Jesus. But yeah, my legs are aching already. So I don't use the bike often. I haven't been to the gym in like four weeks. I need to get back onto that too. Ugh. Fuck, I'm so unfit. I need to get back into it. I really do. I really do. We have reached our destination, Morrison's. I dropped her off there. Stay there. Don't go running anywhere. Do not go anywhere. <sighs> go return this box and go and get herself a drink. Alright, so we got yourself normal Coke Cherry and a couple of Boost Bars just to bring the sugar levels back up. So we'll have that and then we can start cycling back. As I was going to leave Morrison's, I just bumped into me, Mum and Dad and uh, the doggo. She was picking up a parcel from the Amazon locker and they're about to go for a walk in the province. And yeah, the mother told me off to leave my bike without a lock because I don't know where my lock is. And plus, it's a really rusty lock so I don't think it would work well. So yeah, I'm outside Hanford's to go and get a bike lock. And maybe, Jesus Christ, whoever that is with that car, your car's shit, mate. But yeah, um, go see about buying a lock and see how much it is for a full service. Because I think it might be cheaper over here. Alright, so now we are bikeless. We are bikeless. I've dropped her off in Harry. Uh, I've dropped her off in Halfords. Don't know why I was going to say Harry's. <laughs> That's a fucking pub. <laughs> Dropped her off in Halfords. So, uh, getting a new back tyre, getting a new cable thingy for the suspension lock because that doesn't work anymore. And they're gonna. What else are they gonna do? I can't even fucking remember now, but yeah, new back tyre. They're gonna do a new cable for the suspension lock so that'll work. They're gonna give it a good fucking clean. And yeah, pick it up Friday. It was sting me about 60 quid, 55, something along that lines. God, I'm glad I took it to Halfords because Summit Cycles, they would have charged me like over 100 quid. But again, they'd probably like, they would have probably just added on a load of stuff that didn't really need doing. So I don't know. Bring it to Halfords and see how we go from there. So yeah, we're on foot now. Ah, God damn it. Oh well. Oh well, not to worry, not to worry. And then on Friday, I'll buy a bike lock. One that is actually good. Not one that will get rusty. I just have to go with a combination. So hopefully when I pick her up, she'll be a whole new bicycle and riding a bit smoothly. So yeah, they're, they're the experts over in Alfred's. I just sit on it and pedal. Yeah, and the wheels move and the gears change. So yeah, that's all I know. They probably spotted a load of things that I would have never spotted in my life. All I know is there's a bit of rust on the suspension. The suspension lock doesn't work. The tires are bald, well, the back one. And that's it. Didn't notice anything else. But yeah, that's one thing done. Go on, I'm, I'm, I'm very productive today. I am so productive today. First I start the day off sorting a key out from A1 property to get a bin bag from Jerry's room and returning the key. Secondly, I, I buy some Doug D40 for the bike and then I pumped up the tyres. Thirdly, sorted out all the clips, took my bike in for a repair. I thought I would have to book it in for another day or something, but they just took it there and then, so that's lovely. We are walking back into town. What a productive day. You know what? You know what? I deserve a pint. I am having a pint. Thinking about it, I've saved myself a whole lot of money. Because earlier on in the vlog, I said, when I get my student loan, when I get to uni, I'll pay to get it done in the other place, Summit Cycles. And that would have been well over 100 quid. So I've probably saved myself about 100 quid. So yeah. Well done, Joe. Well done. And I wasn't even planning on taking it to Halfords at all. I was not even planning to go on going there. So if I didn't bump in to my parents, I would have still had the bike. <laughs> Just what the doctor did. <sighs> right. 
Right guys, it is a new day, so that means I'm going to end the vlog here. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Like I said, more vlogs are on the way. Literally, the High Res Heaven of the Hollywood tour is on the 23rd and the 24th, so I'll be going to London and Manchester. I'll be doing two separate vlogs for them. Those vlogs are going to be the best vlogs you'll ever see from me. That'll be the best vlog ever. But nonetheless, make sure you guys click the like button, click subscribe, and the bell next to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace out. Working five days a week in a bar. Confidence keeps going up very far. I'ma leave a permanent mark in this game like a motherfucking Harry Potter scar. Yeah, you know I'm going far. You know I'm getting bigger. Every single project guarantee I will deliver because my head is much clearer. I'm feeling like a winner and I'll squash up any critter without a reconsider. Yeah, you know I am the best. You know I'm never stressed. I don't do this to impress. I just do this to express. So any people listening have the courage to refresh. So go out there because your adventure has begun. Hold your head up high so you can hit that home run. Your time starts now. Ready up, player one.